Okay, we're gonna do a video walk around. This is a 1998 Mercedes SL 500. It's a very, very clean car. Um, it's very clean. We said the older gentleman had traded it in. Um, we're gonna start up here in the front so you can kind of see everything. Um, these do work, just so you know, they do work. Um, I said, I said it, has, it has new tires on it, so you don't have to worry about putting tires on it. It's a big thing to me. There's nothing like buying a vehicle and then just a few months down the road, you gotta put tires on it. The, um, it does have a little bit of oxidation, but most of this right here, this is just dirt. Just so you know that that's not, that's just where it's from the, see? It's not the chrome, it's fine. There's a little bit, but not much. Mostly it's just dirt. Paint is very clear, nice and clean. Um, it does have both tops. This has the rag top, and the top does fold down and come back up. These are excellent, really nice and clean. Um, because of the year, I really want to try to focus on so you can see every little detail, the condition all over. So it's not just a, like I said, a flat picture. Um, these are locking, you get to unlock it from on the inside. But, but truly beautiful all the way around. Let me open this up. The remote does work too. We're gonna go ahead and, okay, so we're gonna open the trunk so you can see the inside of it. It really is super, super nice. Um, it's one of those, I feel like even the video is not capturing how clean this is. You know, the, the, this rear area is what I consider showroom. It has the changer in here as well. This is super clean and it's, it looks just like that. It smells clean. It have like that weird old gross smell or anything like that. I'm not sure what that went to, but they left it in there. I'm sure it looks like it's a cap that comes to the back of one of these, but it's still here if you want to attach it, you can, okay? Just trying to catch anything that you'd want to see. Um, this is not all scuffed up. It's definitely just a little cream puff, you know? Give you a chance to look at these two. There is no really surprises on the exterior. Like I said, this top is, is beautiful. Like I said, it does have the hard top that goes with it as well. Um, doors are excellent. And I do upload in HD, so make sure when you watch the video that you do that so you can see it for yourself too. Badges are nice and clean. They're not peeling off. No aging or oxidation there. Once again, there is a little bit of... Um, oxidation to the rims nothing crazy but like i said and they do have a couple but i mean this for the year i would definitely not consider this excessive abuse or anything like that but this is just dirt okay um there's a little minor spot we're here that's it's been touched up at some point in time This is beautiful too. I love how this is aged. This is really super nice. Um, I'm gonna kind of zoom in there so you can see any. There's a few little tiny, these all have been touched up. But they're extremely minor, extremely minor for this year. All right, I'm gonna try to get down too so you can see underneath of it. And then we're gonna go over on the inside, okay? I know this is kind of a long video, but I think that anytime we're looking at stuff like that, we wanna see that. Looks nice. It's in a good life. Okay, so we're going to step inside here. Once again, no surprises on the seat. It really does look like that. I'm going to get super close. Absolutely lovely. This is definitely one of the best condition cars I've seen. That back there, I'm going to go ahead and flip that for you so you can see it. There is a little bit of sun where this on this plastic has aged. So you can see the difference. These little boxes, so you can see that too. They open them up has the Bose sound system in there. They work, the speakers are not tore up or anything. Uh, there's your Carfax information. Okay, go ahead and push this back. Sit down in here. All right, the cup holders are all working beautifully. They're not damaged or snapped or broken. I hope that you can see this too. I'm gonna try to cover anything I can see that you would be interested in seeing. It took me just a second. That's why I had to set it down. So I could show you 
this part here it slides open i have a phone in my hand so it makes things like a little more challenging for me okay it works just fine it's just me i can't do it with one hand so there there we go so what you can see inside the velvet is in good shape no staining um this vehicle has no weird smells it doesn't smell like it's been smoked in um the carpet um is lovely they did not have to do hardly anything to this when it came in he kept it um like this already he had a harley as well and um anyway so here's your seats i'm gonna go ahead and adjust this this is for your top okay i'm gonna go ahead and turn it over so you can see everything okay and look even so a little tag that's kind of cute okay has all those little power seats and stuff like that seats are working i just want to show you that so you can see that too oh. okay and then we're going to do the windows okay um and then there's the top that's up here um this is for your trunk and i i'm going to try to show you how to take the top down okay but this is this is great too there's no damage there i always like seeing that um this is for your uh glove box so you can lock it i'm gonna go ahead and turn this off so you can see that too i don't even know what that does Okay, it does something. This is locking something, and I'm not sure what it does. Okay, but I don't want to. So I guess it probably locks all these boxes all the way around to keep people from going through your stuff in case you have the top down. That would be my best guess. Okay. Um, and then the top. I'm going to put the key in so I can show you the top goes down. It does need to be. It's going to roll the windows down for us. And then it's doing all its little stuff here so you can see it works all right and then i'm going to put it back up for you too so you can see that too all right now you're ready to go um we're going to get i think that's just for your for locks okay we're going to put it back up the other way so we're just going to hit the button and opposite And then it's going to lock down. I love the fact that this is, um, it does it itself. Like you don't have to adjust anything. It just does everything. Very handy. All right. And then it's going to snap back in and it's all done. And it's rolling the windows up and everything. So. All right. Now we're going to show you that like your lights, that they work too. Um, you can have them on how you want. The only thing I did notice because I did flip this down is that um first of all that these are a little fragile and that this one over here is definitely it's damaged okay but on this vehicle this would be the only thing i really would say that you know takes away from it because i mean it's it's pretty pristine as far as everything else um if you have any questions you know on options anything like that just let me know um i'm going to turn it on too so you can hear it um just tell me i need to put my seatbelt on just really super nice too not no dragging no weirdness <laughs> it's just like butter that's beautiful okay i'm missing it over to you uh, like i said this is going to be a long video but i just really felt like you needed to see everything that i could possibly show you on it